efforts here to uh, do something about this backyard. As you can see, it's a hill here. This is a patio. There's a hill here. And I kind of like the hill, but what's happening is that when it rains, mud washes down and it's starting to uh, wash back towards the house. So the plan is to come about here up the hill, go straight across, cut all that dirt out, level this, level this area off, railroad ties here, all the way around, all the way out. Here. Slope this off. That's why I got him pulling up these stumps here. Stump here, a stump here. So I can slope this off and use this hill as a driveway on top as I'm doing already. I'm using this hill as a driveway because we had to terrace this property off because it was a slope down to the front yard. So I use this area up here it's a work area. And I bring my vehicle around this little road here. And I can go on out the front yard. So <clears throat> you can tell here, well, you can tell here where I need to cut that heel off and make that a flat area railroad ties all the way around so what I'm doing right now I got this this gentleman give me prepared for to enter off onto my property because my property line comes down this fence which is adjacent to another property line a good guy by the name of Dirk. I take care of his grass and he's let me come up on his side. But I don't want to keep taking advantage of that. I would like to bring, instead of coming up on his side, I want to come up on my own side. <laughs> so I'm going to bring, I'm going to bring that fence line right there all the way out. Bring that fence line all the way out and I'm coming up on his property right here. He don't have a problem with it, uh, I do. So I'm just trying to do my part to, uh, to be a man and uh, take care of what I need to try to take care of. So in the process, I'm gonna come from this way instead of going that way I'm going to strive to make a driveway that's coming down, down this way. And so I got this gentleman here. He's a pretty good guy. I don't even know his name. I call him the stump man. <clears throat> what he's doing, he just took up one stump down there in that area. And he's going to take up that stump for me also. So I did find out the gentleman's name, is, they call him Boise, Mr. Boise. Uh, heavy equipment operator. Uh, this guy probably about do anything, man. <laughs> but what I see, what, what, uh, what I hear from about, you know, we talked about, I'm kind of like a good judgment of character sometimes. So uh, <laughs> uh, he can just about do anything, man. 
So I, I know it was some viewers asking me what was I gonna do about this hill. And uh uh yeah man it's 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 continuing job. <laughs> we bought this brief piece of property and now we're having to work work with it. So yes, someone had asked the question, what are we gonna do about this hill in the back? Hey, I'm working on it, man. It take money, 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 money. And sometimes when you got folk like like Mr. Boyson, it ain't all about the money sometimes. It's about, you know, helping somebody because uh, uh, everybody need help, including Mr. Boyson. <laughs> and you never know when you can help someone and how it comes back to you, comes back around when you need help. So I'm out here videoing this for my wife. Uh, coming up on this side, and I need to come up on that side. Coming up, going down here, gonna start to make a video, uh, make this area where I can come up and down on my side. And there go my beautiful wife standing in the door. Say hey, babe. Hey. Hey. <laughs> there she go. Say hey. <laughs> Mr. Boyd's right here. Yeah, I seen him. He the one that tore down that uh, that lot down there with them that, that trailer had burned yeah. up. Yeah. Okay. You about. Yeah, yesterday. And so, uh, so I wanted to introduce you to my wife, right. Boise Christie. Right. Nice to meet okay. you. So, so what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go up right up here and cut this yard. I, I uh, she gonna have me on the radio. And, okay. And anytime you, if whatever you need, you just. Knock on That's the door. What I need real quick, and, 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 and I, I, I didn't even think of. I need some fuel. Is that place down there got fuel? Uh, which one? Right there, that, 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 that gas station. Yeah. Uh, I know I'm gonna go up here to the Murphy. Yeah, how quick is you can go get some? Okay, I can go get some. How, how much you need? Yeah, get five gallons. Okay. Yeah, get five. I got all. Hey, hey. well look here. Uh -huh. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Road. You brought the end off of. Yeah. Uh, it was under the ground. Yeah. And you see, see, you see right there, they go another one. But I tell you what, though. It's probably going to go on up that way, too. No, that one coming down towards the house. Watch this right here. Watch this right here. See, there ain't going to be too many more. Once, <laughs> I, once I get them big ones like that right there, uh -huh. that root will do just like this. Twist it around the way I want it. <laughs> yeah, because you're getting it right there. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So oh, this is a root right yes, here? Yeah, sir. Boy, that tree must have been here for years. Yeah. Wow, yeah. that is a big root. It's got to be there. And it seems see like that one trying to give you more problem than this one on it. <laughs> these, 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 these trees here. What is this oak tree? Uh, uh this uh was a uh, uh sweet gum had them look cuckaboard like this. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's a boy. That's a monster tree. Yeah, monster tree. Yeah, it is. This boy. But uh, we gonna bring it up out that ground, buddy. Okay. So let me go get some fuel. <laughs> Dig it right up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I didn't see the little head. That's the man I come around. Man, I just dig it up with my little mini X. Yeah. Oh man, this is a monster. Look at that one. root there. It, look at that root, root there. there. I, I, well, I'm wondering All of this. What kind of tree? <laughs> So as you can see, we started early that morning, uh, around eight o'clock or so. Um, and here it is, uh, a quarter to three, and they're still trying to get that stump out of the ground. It was really stubborn. It took a lot of effort. My husband had to help with his chainsaw, but we finally come to the end of it, you guys. It was almost unbelievable. And this is just step one in the process of getting our backyard where we wanted to be. So stay tuned, more to come. Wow, you guys, eight hours to get this stump out of the ground. It took a lot of sweat, a lot of effort. We had to really break this tree down, but we got it out of the ground. Or I say we because I was a good supervisor, but they got it out of the ground. And I'm really proud of them, really happy that we were able to get this done. Like I said, this is just the first step. And getting the yard uh, where we wanted to be, the yard's gonna have to be graded. Um, uh, we're gonna have to do some landscaping. It's a lot of stuff. We're gonna put gravel down to form the driveway. So a lot of the stumps went back in the ground and covered up with dirt just because that's how we got rid of them. They'll break down under the earth. Um, and now he's leveling it off. Uh, my husband's going to put a barrier up around the yard so that the mud isn't running everywhere if it's raining and do some other stuff. And uh, and Mr. Boise is going to come back and do even more work on the yard to grade it uh, and prepare to put the railroad ties in, which will make a pretty landscaping around the yard. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that this was able to show you mobile home buyers, um, something that you might have to endure if preparing your land, especially if you buy land on an incline like we did. 
You just have to constantly work at getting the land where you want it to be. It takes money, it takes time, it takes effort, and it takes a lot of patience. So just uh, if it's your dream, you can make it uh, happen. Just take it one step at a time. Mr. Boys, it was nice enough to take the tree stump with him. He's just going to throw it out on his property. Um, it'll break down. Um, so we didn't have to get rid of that. And the city of Locust Grove is going to come get those stumps that were left on the side of the road. Thanks so much for watching. Let us know what you feel about the video, you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.